Today, we are taking our talents down to the bottom, the deep bottom of the ocean to see the true life of a Megalodon and apparently why it's so bad. I don't know how it would be bad. I mean, you're one of the biggest sea creatures to have ever lived. I feel like you can just beat anything. You'd have nobody trying to destroy you. You can pretty much destroy anybody you want to. I, let's see why his life's so bad. The video is going to be by Dan Ban. Big shout out to him and let's get right to it. Why it's no fun to be born as a Megalodon. So you're swimming around in your mother's belly. We look, oh, we look you're adorable right now. You look around with your little shark guys. Hey, yo, what's up? What's You've up? Got a brother and a sister in there, too. We've got family in here. Pretty chill so far. Chunks. Beautiful. Your brother just ate your sister's head. I'm sorry. My boy went from it's been chill here so far to now my sister's head just got chopped off. And look at my face over here, bro. I am astonished. I just saw a family on family crime. What led up to that? Look, they're just kind of looking at each other. What this happened? Is pretty chill so far. Chomp. Your Pretty chill so far, Chomp. Head, all while you're still inside your mom. Guys, if you have yet, scroll down. Mom says, Hit that subscribe button. You out into the water like she's taking a big poop. Splish, splash. <laughs> if you can tell from the title and thumbnail you just clicked on, you're a megalodon. You're born at between 6 and 10 feet long. Oh, uh, hold up. Born 6 to 10 feet long. I mean, at 6 to 10 feet? He's already born the same size as me. You know what I'm saying? I'm about 6 foot 5. Okay, no, I'm not I'm about 5'10", but you know what I'm saying? He's born six foot tall. He's already a savage. So, I mean, off the bat, we're born as savages. Nothing can go wrong, right? You figure out where you are in the water, learning to use your fins and Probably. Tail. But it could see, all go your wrong. mom is swimming away from you. Where are you going, mommy? You ask. Mom! Take milk, she says. Oh, okay. What's milk? Okay. Remember, you're just born. She doesn't answer. Wait, and milk? you never see her again. Just like those who never seen no. dad. Grr. No, now he did. it's time to get some food in the tummy. My and mom pulled the, the milk trick on me. Look for something good to eat. That's a rock. That's a fish. Okay. That's a giant. This isn't great. A whale? I need something else to eat. You think to yourself. We can eat that fish? But just when you think you'll never find something worth eating. That wouldn't be bad. You see a sea turtle. Not There's the a turtle. a big old turtle. Minding its business. I don't think you we can eat a shell though, you know? Lick your lips. Chomp. Whoa, dude, what the? Yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. As you crush its shell. Oh! The fish around you scatter, not oh, wanting to be next. Oh, I forgot that we're that, Megalodon. They say to themselves, as blood fills the water around you, as you happily oh, rip off a hundred-year-old turtle who was just chilling. A uh, hundred years shreds. old? Until humans made straws, you know, 3.6 million years from this time period, <laughs> sharks were the biggest threat to these turtles. Now it's Now it's us. straws? That's kind of crazy, by the way. to the ocean floor. Traumatized crabs just watch this play out above them. Poor like, crabs, Oh bro. my god, what just happened? Happen. I need therapy. Your lonely life of eating whatever <laughs> the crab is in front therapy? Of you has just begun. Nothing wants to be your friend. And you see you what I'm saying? Your life alone, eating whatever is there. We can obliterate anything though. From Look turtles, at those kills. Fish, seals, and even other sharks. You eat literally. We had to eat the family. We, we saw our sister's head get chopped. You know. Hunt in deeper and deeper water while you grow. Eventually, you reach 60 feet long. That's okay, wait a minute. We went from six to ten. And then six times ten. We are now 60 feet long. What's the biggest megalodon of all time that they think? You know, it's obviously not proven. But 60 feet is absolutely insane. Three school buses lined up. Don't worry Three about buses? what a school bus is. You won't be around long enough to oh see my. it even exist. Anyways, you're now the apex predator in the water. Wow. Your favorite way to kill big prey apex. is coming up from underneath. Kind of the go-to move Ooh. of any shark, really. That's because a lot of whales have echolocation, which means they'd see you coming literally using sound. To yeah, they'd they see us. They'd see us. Think of echolocation as as oh, we're too quick. Eyes when it's in water, that's too dark to see clearly. It that's kind of crazy. Maps the area in front of you so it doesn't swim right into the shout out to the, the whales or end up on the beach. So there you are. You're swimming along. You look up and see a family of whales. Ah, oh, we're chopping that. Hanging out, playing, just yeah. loving you know, being oh. alive. I love you, honey. The mama whale. Don't do that, bro. Whale. Don't. You I don't can't have to wait to watch our kids grow up. Let's put a stop to that sappy. <laughs> you, you don't have to do that. Toward them rapidly. <laughs> Why do you have to, to, to do kids, all that? The dad or the mom. Either way, no one's gonna see the kids grow up. Eat the dad. up under them. It's gotta be the dad. Jaws wide and slam right up underneath the mom whale. The force of the impact the mom? alone breaks the ribs, and hundreds of your teeth start falling out around oh as the water fills with blood and whale chunks. Our not teeth? Don't worry, you got a lot of replacement teeth. Sharks, oh, even today, okay. have hundreds, if not thousands of teeth ready to lose. Thousands? And grow back in so they can keep eating. But Is that you, true? The megalodon can go through 40,000 teeth in your lifetime. 
Crunch. He chopped down Crunch. even more, splitting Bro, the whale in K? half as her kids scatter away. You That's just insane. A whole whale, and you're still Ooh. hungry. You repeat this process. We're hungry, bro. Let's eat some more. Thousands of times throughout your life, murdering everything you can, eating 2,500 pounds of food every day, and you thought oh, you were hungry. A However, day. One day you're swimming along, and you see another megalodon, but this one is like it's a female. Oh, time to riz up that yacht. Okay, yourself, really? Why do you have to hit me with that? With Why do you have to say that? girl, let me holla at you. I'm let me holla at you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You swim around each other in a sort of primal dance. Swim you around. Poster, I think that's what uh, the Komodo yourself, dragons were doing, bad. right? Or maybe then it was the snakes. The, okay, remember, consent is very important. And you never see her or your kids again. We don't Sharks even see the kids? Wanders. That's crazy. I mean, I wouldn't know from experience. It's your turn to get the Come milk. on now, Every man. Every year or so, you it's our turn again. to get the milk. Sharks just be having kids. They never meet like a soldier on deployment. Sharks but have kids. They never older, meet. The water starts to get colder and you're getting uncomfortable. Even coming across. They can never have a good like family life, you know? Hope nine. These are my kids. You think you need much warmer <laughs> water to survive as do a lot of your favorite snacks like big fish and whales. You're getting hungry and Frankie kind of cranky. What do you Frankie? don't know because you're a shark is that this is the start of an ice age oh you poke no your head out of the water and see a bunch of white oh we're cooked land and for some reason a bunch of water is like a giant solid block off in the distance you see a squirrel <laughs> what's his name into um, a crack in the ice i forgot his name an avalanche i wonder what that's about you think the area of the ocean i that can't think of it surviving gets it's from ice age smaller. more and more of your species are freezing why wouldn't we just swim death. because away cold, you know the other animals you i don't know how it have works the same idea of there you go yeah where it's warmer Meaning just swim away other megalodons have the same idea too to get warm it's now a total survival of the fittest survival of the fittest megalodon lunch style and dinner retreat to where it's warmer but the new species of sharks who are smaller and faster can could you imagine seeing a 60 foot completely shark completely outcompete you for food Bro, no thank you're you doing all that you ask one that will eventually evolve into a great white one day I'm just built different, he says. I'm just built on, different. For many years, the days are longer, colder, and you're too slow oh, to keep man. up. Oh man, we're getting old. Life, slowly starving. We're getting old, and, and we're starving. Mate, the baddies oh, are dead. Brother. You cry as you realize you're one of the last surviving members of the megalodon species. You're so hungry, you'll try and eat anything. Eating smaller meals when a slow and what is that? A chicken leg? To get out of the water and how do we get that? But eventually, nothing. A video popping up on the screen. You're cold. We gotta listen. Hungry. Now. And you're starved out of the picture. We're Finally, starving, cold, and hungry. The bottom of the ocean floor, going extinct from starvation, leaving the modern great white shark and we're as the new boss of the ocean. Yeah, rip megalodons. Well, you heard it here first, guys. Rip megalodons. Let me know in the comments. Do you think there's any uh, megalodons that are still alive today out there somewhere? Maybe in the bottom of the ocean or somewhere we just haven't explored yet? Let me know in the comments. Me personally, I mean, I think it's possible there could be some stuff out there. We've barely explored the ocean. Imagine we pull up on a 60-foot shark. Yep, never going in the ocean again. I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for watching with me. I love ya. Goodbye.